On another important matter, the White House has been in close contact with state and local officials in Hawaii since the initial earthquake and volcanic eruption. The President continues to monitor the ongoing situation. FEMA and the White House encourage all individuals in potentially affected areas to monitor local radio or TV stations for updated emergency information and follow the instructions of state and local officials. As the mayor had said, I uh, called uh, FEMA uh, right away to let them know that we anticipate having uh, an event uh, that we would want their support in. Uh, and then most importantly, I called the White House uh, to let them know that once again, this is a different, I had to explain it's a different event, Hanale and the rainfall that occurred a couple weeks ago um, was a different event and that this new eruption uh, would entail and could entail uh, danger to our community that I felt was very important that we assure that the state, federal, and county assets uh, would be available to keep all of you safe. I wanted to announce today that I have taken uh, action uh, to enable a more comprehensive response to the current eruption uh, situation uh, at, uh, in the East Rift Zone on uh, Hawaii Island. I also would like to announce that I just signed a request to President Trump uh, for declaration of a presidential disaster uh, for Hawaii County as part of uh, this uh, eruption uh, and the activities on the East um, Rift Zone on Hawaii Island. Um, we believe that we will exceed the threshold and we are working to um, seek the disaster uh, declaration uh, to ensure that we have access to federal, state, and county resources uh, should we need that as the, as the event progresses.